our jellyfish. Uh, looks a little odd here because I've got six 160s. I'm making this guy all out of pink. Normally when I make a jellyfish I'll make him out of clear but I didn't think that would show it very good on the videotape so I chose a color you can see. And all of these 160s I've just put a puff of air in them and tied them off. I was going to be his tentacles hanging down in a moment. Or his little strands and then I've got three 260s all inflated with about five or six inches left uninflated. We're going to start with one of them. What you're going to do is you're going to make about a two inch bubble, make a half inch bubble, make that into a pinch twist. Then we're going to come up and make about a five inch bubble there. And we're going to make another bubble the same size. You can let go of that if you want to. Another half inch bubble, make that into a pinch twist. And then one more bubble the same size as that first one we started with. And then trim the excess off. Once you trim that excess off, then just tie that off there. Set that aside. Now what we're going to do is repeat that same process. So, two inch bubble, pinch twist. And now you want these all the same size. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up and measure that. But you want to twist in there so it's soft enough. So measure that till it's the same size. Your other pinch twist. And then again, your two inch on the end. Remove the excess. Tie it off. And one more time with our third balloon. So your two inch bubble, your pinch twist. Put a twist there so that it's soft. Other side, your other pinch twist. And again, one more two inch bubble. And we're going to tie this off here. Now what we're going to do is take these, divide them in half. Take the first one, take the second one, and then twist those two together, just like that. And then let's take our third one, do the same thing, and just lock all of those together. Now all we need to do is we're going to take each of these little ends and attach them to the pinch twist that will be next to them. So grab that one. Twist that around a pinch twist. Grab the end of that. Grab another one. Twist that around a pinch twist. And then you're just going to work your way all the way around until you have all six of these loose ends connected to the next pinch twist in line. And what will happen is as you pull these around, you can see where it's starting to pull it down into shape here. And then once you get your last one, twist that around there. And let's kind of you spread these out a little bit. Turn all your pinch twists down. There is the dome, or the upper part of our jellyfish. Then you just take your 160s and just to twist them into each of the pinch twists. And you want them hanging down. So you get all six attached. And there you've got a cute little jellyfish.